Hi, Grandma's hands. I just wanted to share some things with you why I am cutting up all of these mushrooms that I purchased yesterday. I just wanted to show you some other things that you can do with them. So, actually I've been cutting them forever and I'm kind of tired, but I'm down to the last about seven mushrooms. I had through six whole trays. Okay, so you all know I make the bacon out of them, right? This is the thin sliced ones that I'm going to freeze up and make bacon out of. So I told you all at one time when I did a video about the bacon, this very end part here, oh, here's one right here. It is very tough. So I usually cut this part off here. So I was looking at all of these pieces piled up over there and I decided that, yeah, hey, I'm gonna try to make some little shrimps out of them. Okay, I just cut the middle out. And I know a lot of people have a problem with this because they don't understand why people try to substitute food instead of just eating the real food. Well, I don't know about anybody else, but if you know me, you know I have health issues. Me eating this way helps me to feel better. So I would hope nobody has a problem with that. This is why I eat this way. I told you all, I cut all the heads off, which are these brown people with, you know, their brown head part. I spite, I season, the, I freeze these as well. And when I thaw them out, I season them up. I throw them in the air fryer. This keeps me from grabbing a bag of chips. Uh, also, for the first time today, I made some little thin coins. That's also going to be a snack. Okay, and these are just odd and end pieces that, you know, that was cut differently, but this is all those hard ones. I have to decide what I'm going to do with them. But these are just pieces that was just, like I said, odds and ends or where I cut the centers out of them. So this will also be a snack. And so another thing that if you don't, so I was taking these ends and that's when I showed you that I was going to make shrimps out of them but in the event that i cannot get this soft enough even if i you know try to steam it and get it soft before i batter it and make a shrimp out of it i don't know if it's still going to be tender enough to use so what i'm going to do so what i'm doing over here is i just split one of these down the middle and that's what i'm doing over here and then I am just cutting the middle out of it and making these into shrimps because, see, these are tender. I know these are going to make, you know, a good shrimp, but I don't know if those tough ones will. So I, this is just some backup. And if they both work out, then fine, they both work out. So as I was making this, I said, well, I could prepare for like a seafood plate. And so I actually cut down some smaller ones and these are going to be oysters. So I'll have my oysters, my shrimps, and then I'll use my banana blossoms to make my fish. And another uh, misconception, because I know a lot of people don't understand when they ask me, are you vegan? And I say, I'm plant-based. And they kind of give me that look like, well, what's the difference? Where well, there is a difference between plant-based and vegan. If you are vegan, that means not only do you not do meat products or meat byproducts, you also don't do vitamins that may came from an animal. You don't do a purse that's not vegan you don't do clothing that may have animals in it you don't do shoes that may have had an animal in it i it's not that serious for me like i said i am doing this because it helps my body 
to feel good. So that's why I say I am plant-based and I am not vegan. I'm only doing whatever it takes to make me feel good. And the rest of that is not that serious to me. So I hope that helps. If anybody want to, because everybody has been, well, not everybody, but a lot of people have been inquiring about this mushroom thing. But like I said, snacks. This will be a little thin chip snack. Bacon, mushrooms, oysters, any other little odd pieces can also just uh, season them and throw them in the air fryer and snack on them like you would any other snack. It's a healthier snack than grabbing chips. So I hope that helps everyone. Thank you very much for watching. I pray for you. You pray for me and we'll watch God change things. God bless everybody.